Hey guys, in this video we're getting three achievements in the Temple of Jean level, and yes, that is how you pronounce it. I will fight to the death over this. The first one's nice and easy. You just need to wait until the first ball swings towards the side that you want to run down and start running. If you keep going straight ahead, then you will make it past all of them without any hitting. Once I made it through, I for some reason didn't stop running and just landed straight into the lava ahead. And then the achievement popped as I'm dying. So I, just, I guess that it doesn't matter if you die at the end. You know what? Before going into the next achievement, I think we all need a bit of a laugh. So this was the first time that I ran through the spider cave. I decided to record myself because I hate jump scares and thought I would have some funny reactions. Turns out there was only really one big reaction. Him. Now let's move on to the achievement. First thing I should mention is you will see me pull out a lot of flares here. I will be throwing them to indicate where the spiders are going to come from. I could also tell you vaguely where the spiders are going to come from, but it's another case of if you look at the video you can see. Speaking of the video, it is pitch black in here and I found out very quickly that, at least for me, switching to old graphics brightened things up a bit and I have brightened the video up considerably in the editor but it's still not doing much. Just moving around the cave with your guns out at all times seems to be the best idea as Lara will auto lock onto spiders before you can even see them. And once you do lock onto a spider, don't progress forward anymore. Whilst shooting at the spider, move backwards so that you don't risk triggering any more spiders. Overall, this achievement seems to be finicky, which isn't surprising judging by all the other achievements in the game. I've seen people comment on numerous different issues with it, things that void the achievement and other people will be contradicting that and it, it's a mess. There are plenty of things I did in this video that made me think I'm not going to get this achievement and then suddenly it just popped after I killed the last spider. So because I know that these are things that have caused some people not to get the achievement, I'm just going to list them here. Even though, again, I did pretty much all of these by accident on my run through and the achievement still popped. So if the achievement doesn't pop after you've killed the last spider, it could be one or a couple or all of them. I feel so bad for you if they're all of them. The first issue is very reminiscent of the one that we had with the Crocodile Rock achievement. The description specifying that it's just the spiders in the cave, except people have claimed that the achievement doesn't unlock if any spiders anywhere in the level hurt you. I say hurt, but another thing that people have been saying is that it's not just spiders hurting you, it's if a spider touches you, it voids the achievement. Those two alone are frustrating enough, but people have also reported saving, using flares, pulling out another weapon besides Lara's pistols, even just for a second, or using a med kit can also void the achievement. So realistically, it's another achievement in the remasters that comes down to luck really. So that is very frustrating. You can do everything right and the achievement still decides it's not going to pop. So apart from showing you the locations of all the spiders, the only other thing I can do really is wish you luck.
So this achievement has a fun little backstory. Well, I say fun, assuming everyone else is a massive Tomb Raider nerd like me. But anyway, much like in the first game, there was a screw up when they were designing the level. Here, they added a ladder texture, but they forgot to put the collision on it. So if you were to jump at the ladder, you'd just hit the wall and fall. So there was no way to get to this med kit. It was only actually a few years ago that the community managed to find a way to get to it. It was a setup that required many, many steps, but ultimately the way that dumb people like me understand it is it amounted to a very, very complex corner bug. So when I first saw the achievement list and saw that on there, I thought, oh my God, they're gonna get me to try and do this ridiculous setup with the corner bug. But they didn't. The achievement, it, it kind of bugs me because of its title, because it's, it's not right. They essentially added the collision onto the ladder. So now you can pretty easily get to the med kit. So it's not unreachable at all that I should speak about the setup here instead of ranting. So when you get here, you want to position Lara on the far left side of the block. Then hop backwards like you're going to do a running jump and either run straight off the edge of the ledge or do a standing jump and that should land Lara on the block down by the water. You will take a little bit of damage but shouldn't be too bad. Then you want to set up a running jump here to grab the ladder because that block at the base of the ladder is a slope and if you fall onto it you will slide into the water and have to reset. When you climb into the little alcove at the top and pick up the med kit, the achievement should pop. From there, you will have to jump into the water and swim back round to get to where you were before. 